Hey everybody, Sam back once again, and yes, I'm in front of the camera this time, and you can see the face and the beard. So the beard, as you can probably see, has grown in a little bit from last time I was uh, on camera, I think. Yeah. And we're here to do one thing, and one thing only. Give away one of these bad boys, yes. The Huawei Nova Plus. Now, I've unboxed this video, unboxed this video, I've unboxed this phone. As you can tell, I don't script my videos. I've just unboxed this phone around seven or eight hours ago, maybe a little bit longer. And now we're here to give one away. Now, if you've not seen the unboxing, my first question to you would be why? I'll give you a second answer. <laughs> I'm only joking. If you've not seen it, then there is a link just down here. Go check out the actual video where I show you more of a kind of in-depth around the phone. And I'm going to give you a couple of my key kind of features of the phone as what would make me buy this phone. Again, I've had it for a limited time, but I'm going to give you a couple of reasons why I would buy it off my first impressions. Number one, the fingerprint scanner. Quite literally, it is one of the best fingerprint scanners on the market. I've got a Mate 9, my wife's got a P9, I've had the Honor 7, I've had the Honor 5X. I've had a couple of other devices that have got this similar kind of fingerprint scanner from Huawei. And they're just fast, they're so accurate. Um, again, I'll just kind of show you now. So if I tap it, boom, we're straight into the phone. Uh, tap it again, and boom, we're into there. And we'll do one more, boom, we're straight into the phone. So three for three. Again, I think I might have had one, one or two kind of missed ones but I've got sweaty fingers right now, as I just said, because I'm not used to uh, talking to the camera directly. And it never misses a beat. Again, it's probably the best fingerprint scanner that, that's on the market. Huawei just hit the nail on the head with these fingerprint scanners. Number two would be just above it with that actual camera. Now, I'm just gonna see if I can show you a picture that I took of my son earlier. Now, here's the picture. What I'll try and do, because it might not look the greatest on the screen right about now, I've got two pictures, so I'm going to put one either side. So there's going to be one here, one here, and you can actually see the quality of that picture. They were the first two pictures I ever took with this phone. I literally took it out of the box, did the unboxing. I then did the setup video. I then took the pictures. So no faffing around, just in automatic mode, no settings or anything. Just take the picture, boom, Bob's your uncle, and there you go, there's two pictures of my son. And I was very impressed. To say it's not the, a flagship device, it gave me like the flagship style of picture in terms of the crispness, the quality, the focus, and the speed of taking the picture. Again, this is a first impressions. I don't know if it's gonna get slower, I don't know if it's gonna get any better, but my first impressions are the camera is absolutely top notch. So there are two. Number three, the build quality. Now, I just love metal phones. Now, I have got the Mate 9, I actually honestly wish the Mate 9 had this kind of finish. So it's got a brushed kind of metal on there. And the gold color, now there are other companies that do gold. Obviously Apple does gold, Samsung does gold. There's many other companies out there that do gold phones. I think Huawei, for my personal preference, has probably got the nicest gold color. And uh, the phone I'm gonna be giving away will be exactly the same color as this. It is a gold phone. So if you're a fan of gold phones, then Hey, welcome. I also like the fact that the gold matches all the way around from the sides to the front. So it's none of it's like a different color, like a white front and a gold back. It's all one. Again, that's my personal preference. It just kind of flows a bit better around the phone. But in terms of the build quality, again, it feels awesome. But it feels pretty light. I was actually very impressed by how sturdy it feels, but yet how light it is, but yet it's got a large battery. So there is that. So that's it, There's, they're my top three things. There are other things to include, like the screen, a beautiful 5.5 inch 1080p display. It's got three gigabytes of RAM, so it's gonna be nice and kind of snappy. 32 gig of internal storage, eight megapixel front facing camera, USB type C <laughs> charging. I could go on and on and on, but my top three, why I would buy this phone right now out of the box would be that. The fingerprint scanner, the camera, and the build quality. For me, you just can't match it. Now, I think the Mate 9 is almost twice the price as this one. I'm, I'm surprised how, how competitive this is in terms of the way it feels. Now again, it's rocking, rocking his Snapdragon 625 with the three gig of RAM. And again, first impressions that the way that Huawei do though, their phones with the Emotion UI or EMUI, it's very snappy, it just, it just works. You're swigging around, tapping apps in and out. It is just very fast and fluid. But you're thinking, Sam, 
come on mate, you've gone through all that kind of stuff. How the hell do I win this phone? Yeah, okay, I'll answer your question. So there's gonna be a couple of rules. There's always gonna be rules. Number one is gonna be the fact that I can't ship it everywhere in the world. Actually, I lied. I shipped this anywhere in the world. I wanna say thank you to Huawei for sponsoring this video. They sent me this, vid this uh, device here for review, but they're also gonna give a brand spanking new one away, and it will come just like this, in a brand new box, all sealed up for you. And you're thinking, okay, so it's anywhere in the world. Now, define anywhere, Sam, because do you mean Europe? Do you mean just the UK? No, if you're in India, if you're in the Philippines, all my Filipino friends, Australia, America, Malta, the UK, Norway, Finland, you name it, anywhere in the world, apart from China. <laughs> That's the one caveat. So any country worldwide by China, you can win this phone. Now, just to tell you that it is gonna be a European device, so it may not work with all carriers around the world. An example, America, you've kind of got some really fudgy kind of uh, bandings for your phones. It will work on AT&T and it will also work on T-Mobile, but I don't think it's gonna work on Verizon and Sprint. If it does, it'll be in a limited capacity. So there is that. So again, you might wanna check if it, even if it don't work, come on, it's a free phone and it's a bloody good phone. So what do I need to do to enter? I heard you ask, yeah. No, you, yeah, yeah, you, yeah. Okay, there's a couple of different things. I need you to like this video. Obviously, liking a video is always a nice thing anyway. So if you're not hit the like button, then go on, hit the like button right about now. Subscribe to this channel. I will put a link here, just covering the little uh, kissy smiley face. And you can click that, subscribe to the, my channel. If you're not subscribed already, then I am back. I'm gonna be doing more regular videos, probably once every week, maybe twice a week, depending on the schedule I can get going. But I am back and I'm gonna be hitting it, you know, kind of full throttle, let's say. Um, number one's going to be one of this review of this device, Mate 9. Got some other cool products that I've actually got in as well, so stay tuned for that. So yeah, like the video, subscribe, and also leave a comment down below as to why you want this phone for one of the key features. An example, I want this phone because I want to take pictures of my cat. I'm a cat lady, or a cat dude. I want to take pictures of my son, I don't know. Whatever it would be, I want to unlock my phone just because I find it fun. Whatever your, your reason may be, leave a comment down below telling me why you want this phone for the particular kind of the key selling points, let's say. It's got like camera, fingerprint, build, screen. You tell me why you want the phone in a comment down below. Now, what I also want you to do is go to Huawei's Facebook page, Huawei's Twitter page, and Huawei's YouTube. Obviously, go, uh, go subscribe, go follow them on Twitter, and go like the page on Facebook. Now, they're just the key entries. If you wanna get extra entries to the giveaway, there are other ones as well. I'm gonna link it down below, so you can just click the link, it'll tell you all the information you need to know. But the key ones is subscribe to me, subscribe to, to Huawei on YouTube. Make sure you are following Huawei on Twitter and on Facebook. You don't have to do that for me. I would appreciate it, but you don't have to do that for me. Like this video, but the most important one, if you don't do this and you've done all the rest, you've kind of canceled yourself out, is leave a comment down below telling me why you want this phone for what feature. And that's it, that's all you have to do. Now, as when this video goes live, there'll be a winner announced two weeks later. Yes, only two weeks to find out the winner. And that'll be announced on my, on my uh, Twitter page, I'm gonna say my YouTube page, on my Twitter page, my Twitter page, and my Twitter, yeah, my Twitter page, my Twitter account. I don't know, Twitter page. So if you want to be following me, if you want to find out you're going to win, you might want to follow me on Twitter as well. Yeah. Anyway, people, the full terms and conditions of the giveaway are down below. If you want to, got any, if you have got any questions about this while you're at it, then leave them down below because, again, I've got one, so ask away. Anyway, people, I want to say thank you for watching. Been a bit longer than I expected, but again, as you know, I am a non-scripted channel. I just talk random stuff, and whatever comes out, comes out. So if you like this kind of stuff, then yeah, stick around for more. Anyway, people, I wanna say thank you for watching and hopefully you'll see me, maybe not face to face, because again, I find it a little bit more awkward. But hey, if you like it, let me know. I'll try my best. Yeah. <laughs> Cheers, everyone.